talking about. Just what I came after. Oh, you nut. Like seven pounds? Oh, yeah, we got some back and forth. Oh my god! Oh shit! Ah! Ah! Got it! Holy crap! episode is red ears in the rain i just got a nice red ear the biggest red ear i've caught out of this place and i've caught 50 of them everyone's been six inches and i finally got an eight incher using red wigglers and a bobber it was a real nice day, real mild and cloudy the whole day. It starts raining right when we pull in here. But we wasted all the time and energy and now our wipers don't work so we have to stay here for a little while. So I decided to get on some of these shell crackers. We're finally a real girthy, nice one. That one really caught me off guard because I've just set, I've caught five of them. I just haven't had my camera on, and everyone's been exactly the same. They've all been six inches. And I was joking around with her. I said, "Boy, I'm just going to keep trying this till I get a 12 incher." And I said, "If I eventually might get one," and then the next very next second, my bobber went completely under, and I got a big a big one. Now it's not no 12 inches, but it's a nicer one than the ones I've been getting. So. Uh, there's a little hope now. I do know there is potential for larger ones in here. That's that being the biggest one I've ever caught, in fact. There was just a few here. It's not but a foot deep. That's why there wasn't really that many. It ain't like you can sit here and catch a hundred. I did get one more. All right, and it quit raining. That's what I'm wanting. All righty. God. Oh, stop it. Strange. I guess I can go over and try to get them where I got them with Virgil. Didn't really hit that much. Nice one. Look at that one. That's a bluegill, guys. Big, fat male bluegill. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Barely put my hand around him. bucket if I would have landed him. Oh, 
like that. All right, folks, another eight inch bluegill. Whew. Yes, what a hog, real girthy too. Big bluegill. That's two giant bluegills I got now. And I gotta change my camera battery now. All right, Wilma just caught one last fish before we head to the other place. We're gonna go look at a new place that we've never been to and just get, at least look at it and maybe try it for a little bit. I might wait around or fish under the bridge. Yeah, man, that's a nice bluegill there. That's a, it's as big as they get in here, but they ain't bad. Goodness gracious, yeah. Wow, that's a hoss. Another eight inch, or they're right at eight, maybe seven and a half. Well, the bucket's exactly 12. He's seven, exactly seven, because that would be six, seven inches. No, keep it. No. We already got that many, you might as well. Might as well. You're not gonna hurt the population in here. This thing's eight miles long, honey. It's eight miles long. Nobody fishes it. You're not gonna hurt them. Nah, I can use this still. Oh, now Wilma's got a crappie, guys. Nice black crappie, and that one's got color to him. Mine was plain white, and hers is, man, a worm and bobber, guys. Hold that up for us. I'm gonna get a good. I'll zoom in on you. Good job. Hold on, I'm zooming right now as we speak. Well, we got a nice black crappie. It's a real nice one. Mine had no color, and hers had absolutely, absolutely all kinds of spots on it. It's strange. Usually, when the water's this murky, they don't they lose their color. Okay. Good job. Awesome. Huh, right when I was wanting to leave too, I guess stay a little bit. <clears throat> they just started biting the crappie did. It, it's safe to eat them. It's cleaner than you think or they wouldn't be in here. Bow fin, get the net, get the net, get the net. Finally got a bow fin, guys. I've been after one of these for three weeks. I knew that if I fished for red ears and crappie long enough that I'd get a bow fin. Yes, it's a small one, but hey, it's a bow fin. Finally, I got a bow fin. Didn't even know it was on there. I was pulling it up to move my bobber and he was on there. How cool is that, guys? Didn't even know he was on there at all. Wasn't giving me any kind of signal. Didn't even, the bobber didn't even slightly move at all. All right, you're gonna have to take the camera off my head. All right, guys, nice little bow fin. A little one pounder, but I'm happy to get one. I've been trying to get a bow in for three weeks now. That's why we keep coming to the Cypress Swamps for. All right, folks. I, once again, I didn't have the camera on. I didn't realize Wilma turned it off. Me and her just got doubles. She got a nice seven inch bluegill, and I got a nine inch crappie. Right at the same time, we both pulled them out of the water. Boy, they are biting good. 
it's been sprinkling for four hours and they have not stopped biting since it's been sprinkling wow you know how long that took this time 15 seconds there's that many down there 15 seconds I had a fish all right guys awesome day kind of a frustrating day but we ended up doing really good this last half hour really helped we just got three nice crappie and the bow fin and another giant bluegill we got a enough for to feed four people now if we wanted yeah they are man that's a nice bluegill gosh them are as big as the ones in the church yeah we almost just got another there are, these bluegill are seven to eight inches every one except the one i just caught for some reason <coughs> gosh guys nice bluegill